Okay, it's got a little bit of bonus content for you here. Yeah. Andy was renowned uh, when he used to fight for his left up to the body. He stopped a lot of people with it and uh, a lot of top level fighters with it. He was really, really strong and well known for that shot. Okay, so Andy's just going to go through now uh, five different ways you can land the body shot. Okay, um, like I said, I've been renowned from my career for that left up to the body especially. Um, you don't need to knock your opponent out of it, it's just wearing them down and tiring them out and then like rounds three, four, five of them can push through. One thing that people do with the body shot is they go too far, so you'll see a lot of people dipping the body weight all the way down which is dangerous, you can get with an elbow or even a knee if you're not being too careful. And not punching too far around, you're aiming, if you're using the body pad as a guide, you're aiming the line in between, that's where you want to be aiming. And how I like to set it up is I hit a round first, so I'm hitting like this first. When I know I've hurt my opponent, I turn it up a little bit, so it's in between a hook and an uppercut. Okay? So the first combination we're going to do to set the body shot, just nice and simple, just bringing the hands up with the one two, so his hands come nice and high, dipping that body shot in, using your body mechanics. So as you twist off the right hand, your body's in line, uh, your body's in line left leg bent, so you drive the power off there, driving the power in. Okay, so there, one, two, body shot. And again, one more time, good, nice and easy. The second one, I use a little hop and a little skip. So I'm just going to lift my leg up like I'm on a tee or I'm going to fake into the knee, and it brings your opponent's hands up because they think they need this leg. As that comes up as I land, that's when I drive the body weight in. As my leg, as my leg lands on the floor, I'm bouncing into the shot. So I'll do this little slide, ah, big power in that shot. And again, lift the slide, ah, and again, one more. Move nice and high, really sell. Up, ah, and again. Okay, another one. We're going to start with the right hand this time, we're going to go left up head first. So we're setting them up. So we've got right hand, left hook, recalling your body back to position. Next time, we're going to fake the right hand so it causes them to twitch and hands come up, and then we're going to roll down to the body, okay? So there, right hand, left up. Fake it, put that in the body shot. Concentrate on don't get your legs too wide. Don't want to step too wide there, just rough balance, okay? So there, right hand, left up. Fake it, whoop, ah, body shot. One more time. Okay, the fourth one, we're going to set this body shot up by elbow in as well. Obviously, if we're close range, we're going to set up the right hand and the right elbow. I'll say, you see a lot of people touching the body weight. While I'm here, I want to pull his hands up with the elbow, I've left all this wide open so that left foot can go down again. So we're going right hand, right elbow, so one. One, two there, rotate the elbow, to the body. Okay? So there, punch elbow, boom, boom, touch there. Elbow, boom, boom, body shot. One more time. Ah, ah. Okay, the last one, we're just going to use our left kick. We're going to use the left kick, and as we land, it's a little bounce in your foot. It's the same as when we use the hop. Your toes land, and that's what pushes your body weight in. Driving your hips through. So from there, you go left kick as you land, bouncing into that left hook to the body. Okay, so there, and again, and one more, 